this will be my re review spoiler discussion on Frozen 2. Yes, it's been out for a little while, but I recently just watched it for the first time. Spoilers. Turtles breathe through their butts. <laughs> Quoted by Olaf himself. That was messed up. But very creative. Very, very creative. The movie was really, really good. I really enjoyed it. I plan to go back and rewatch it again and again. It was very, very different vibes off of this movie compared to the first Frozen. Um, I love the music in it. Uh, the tone of it, of the movie, was really, really dark. Pretty dark. Nothing wrong with that. It was actually really good. Um, it kind of did a little bit of um, going back to the past. It's like it was all about... Elsa and Anna's parents, uh, and Elsa was like feeling like she's being blamed for killing her parents, um, but it wasn't really her fault actually because it was her parents' uh, choice. Um, and then uh, Elsa gets an upgrade in her power just a little bit. She becomes known as the fifth spirit after she goes and uh, hunts down um, the secrets and answers of the past and uh, it was really really good it was, it was really good I really enjoyed it um, at first I wasn't so sure that I wanted to see the film because there was a lot of talking about the film but I'm not going to go into that stuff. Um, but I finally decided to see it. After I heard from, from some other people that saw the film. And they said it was really good. So I finally decided I'm going to watch this movie now. But uh, Kristoff um, proposed to Anna. She said yes. So that was great. Um, Olaf died again. After um, Elsa was frozen solid once again. But of course Anna saved um, Elsa again. Which is fine, you know. Um, stuff like that can be repeated. And so Olaf is brought back to life, which is fantastic. He was very, very silly in this movie, which is nothing wrong with that at all. I mean, that's who Olaf is. He's very, very silly. <laughs> Oh, look, I've just been impaled. <laughs> All the messed up quote from the first film. But, um, yeah, I don't... I know I just just watched the movie, and I'm trying to remember stuff about it. Uh, there was this clan of people that lived in the forest. I cannot remember their names right now. That's really, really bad. And then it was um, some other people from, from Arendelle, I believe, in the past... And they were both connected by uh, Elsa and Anna's parents, mother and father. And they were able to find out that um, the two clans, the two groups of people could be connected and lived in peace. Uh, and they were being connected together f by a bridge. And the bridge got destroyed by these giants that got woken up by Anna. And... Uh, these giants were made out of rocks. And, uh, such a good movie. I mean, I was getting, when I first saw the trailer for this film, um, I was, I was getting vibes of Lord of the Rings off of it just a little bit because this movie is very adventurous. I mean, you go on an adventure in this movie. The tone is different from the first movie. Like I said, the tone is a lot different. Um, I actually enjoy this movie more than the first one, which I will go back and rewatch the first movie also. And Olaf's Frozen Adventure was actually pretty good as well. But I enjoyed this one more. Um, I like adventure films, and this is what this movie was. It was an adventure. It was just so, so good. I really recommend this film. And, um, 
at the end, um, Anna became queen, and Elsa, I guess, became queen of the forest, of those people that live in the forest, and, um, oh, and what's really, really cool was, it was awesome, um, on, on Elsa's way to get answers from the past, um, in the trailer, she was running across the water, using her ice powers to get across the water, and she was struggling to get over it. Well, part of her struggle was because of this water horse in the water. And so she got on the horse and tamed it and was able to ride it. And so now the horse is like her best friend or her pet, however you want to say it. So now she rides on a horse now, a water horse. And the special effects in the movie is really, really awesome. Really enjoyed it. Um... I'm trying to see if I can remember anything else from the film because I've only watched it one time. But um, I'm definitely going to rewatch it again. Very very good. I enjoyed it. Cannot wait for Frozen Three. Um, I think Frozen Three is in the early stages of development. The last time I heard about it, uh, but we are getting a Frozen Three, so that's cool. But um, yeah, really really good. I enjoyed it. Um, I think I'm going to end this video right here. Um, oh, and I, and I will also say I I love the fact that this movie had a autumn uh, seasonal tone to it. To where the first movie was focused like on snow and stuff and ice and all that. And this one... It had a little bit of ice and snow in it, but it was mainly like autumn, so it was like the leaves changing and all that. It so it looked it was a very very different film, and it was I really enjoyed it, really really enjoyed it. I'm Lynn. If you enjoy my content, please hit the subscribe. Oh, before I end the video, I Elsa's powers were in really enhanced not because she was upgraded before she was even upgraded her, her powers have just gotten like much much better i mean there was a moment where in, in the forest where she was using her powers when the forest had caught on fire and when if this lizard creature that was able to catch itself on fire i just i just remembered about this now and so she was able to uh contain the fire contain the fire with her ice powers and and she was like she was doing like this and using her powers to con to, to contain the fire in the forest and she was seeing um, moments from the past with, with within using her powers and stuff like that but uh, yeah and then that lizard uh, creature that fire lizard creature uh, she was able to hold it and stuff like that and it was just such a good movie alright I think that's all I'm going to say now alright I'm Auckland if you enjoy my content please hit the subscribe button like button also share with your friends who don't mind also please comment ask me a question or comment in general I'll do my best to answer them also if you don't mind hit the notification bell down below and you will be notified when I go live or upload another video and I will give this movie a 8 out of 10. How about that? Alright. Thank you so much. Alright. Bye. Do you want to build a snowman? Again.